Keeley Hawes revealed the huge teddy bear-like dog that she and her husband Matthew Matt Fadian adopted from Battersea. The actress, 47, shared the happy news to Instagram alongside a sweet photo of herself and their latest addition to the family, a golden doodle. Keeley could be seen as she cradled her dog, Buster, while another gigantic fluffy animal took center stage in the comedic snap. She captioned the photo, Thank you, Battersea, for the newest member of our family. We couldn't love her more. Buster is recovering. The vicar of Dibley Star has been vocal about her support for Battersea dogs and cats home in the past, often sharing an insight into her visits to the rescue center online. Keeley has completely changed up her look as she stepped back in time for her new role. The actress is starring in the BBC's star-studded production of Gil Hornby's best-selling and much-loved novel Miss Oz. The adaptation, from BAFTA-winning writer Andrea Gibb, sees Keeley star as Cassandra Austin who discovers a stash of Jane Austen's private letters after her death. Transforming herself for the role, Keeley has ditched her golden choppy bob and dyed her hair a dark brunette. In newly released pictures, the star's locks were styled in a wavy chignon as she kept her makeup to a minimum, and in keeping with the 1830 setting, she is seen in an old-fashioned navy, long-sleeved dress. Keeley will star alongside Patsy Farron, Jessica Hines, and Murren Mack in the four-part drama, directed by BAFTA-winning filmmaker Ashling Walsh. Filming for the literary mystery began in the UK last month with an expected release date scheduled for late 2024. The plot follows Cassandra Austin notoriously burning her famous sister Jane's letters and reimagines it as a fascinating, witty and heartbreaking story of sisterly love, while creating in Cassandra a character as captivating as any Austin heroine. The drama begins in 1830, a while after Jane has died. Cassandra races to see her young friend Isabella who is about to lose her home following her father's death. Cassandra is ostensibly there to help her friend, but her real motive is to find a stash of private letters which, in the wrong hand, could destroy Jane's reputation. On discovering them, Cassandra is overwhelmed as she is transported back to her youth. In flashback, we meet young Cassie and Jane as they navigate the infatuation, family feuds and dashed hopes which shaped their lives and laid the foundations for Jane's unforgettable stories. Cassandra's re-evaluation of her past eventually leads her to realize how blind she has been to the real cause of Isabella's heartache and distress. Finding a way to guide Isabella towards true happiness, Cassandra is finally able to understand and celebrate the sacrifices she chose to make for her brilliant sister, Jane. Speaking about the show, Sue Dietz, head of BBC Program Acquisition, said, Miss Austin is the perfect blend of intriguing mystery, vivid and engaging characters, and beguiling period charm. BBC viewers certainly have a treat in store.